Zach, why don't you kick us off, huh, buddy? Ladies and gentlemen, surprise to Kenny. It's his birthday, birthday! today. Hell yeah. Because he's you a jolly good fellow. Because he's a Lauren Brandy. Birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Kenny. Everyone, please, please. Happy birthday to you. What does the cake say? What does the cake say? Happy birthday, corner guy. <laughs> yeah. 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 You're, th right. you're 31, right? 31. Yeah. yeah. That's a scary number to look at. Let me, uh, here, I'm going to show the, the camera. Here we go. There's corners. Don't slide off. Do you want to know the original wording of that? Yeah. It was cummer guy. <laughs> <laughs> and she fixed it for me. <laughs> yeah, I got a whole story about that. Yes, happy birthday, Kenny! Happy birthday! What'd you wish for? Yeah, not to be in the corner. No! Oh. Oh. Sit back down there, big guy! Well, Kenny, guess what? That's not all we have for your birthday. What? Yeah, we got another little surprise for you. No more surprises. Yeah, we got that another was little surprise. Listen, we, we appreciate Kenny so much. <laughs> and uh, Kenny, do you, uh, do you like uh, Ed Sheeran? Not really, no. Okay, well, that's it's <laughs> too <dope>. bad. <laughs> <laughs> Kenny, why don't you go ahead and open that link that says Waleed's link? And okay. uh, I got, I've spent a lot of money on this. Both me and Zach spent a lot of money on mm -hmm. this. Like mm -hmm. recording time, we flew out to New York. It was it was a lot, all right? Ed so, Sheeran's expensive. He's very yeah. expensive these days, yeah. <laughs> okay, that all right. That ginger son of a bitch. He's <laughs> <laughs> ginger, yes, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, sorry. Anyways, uh, go ahead, put the volume up. Everyone, and everyone right. I want everyone to embrace the song here, Okay, right? so this is by Ed Sheeran. Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. Shadows of the studio, right, he stands alone. The unsung hero, corner guy, Kenny is his name. Quietly observing his presence, rarely known. He's been through it all, Beautiful. but he's still playing the game. The laughter fills the room, the conversations flow. But Kenny remains unseen, just a small piece of the show. <laughs> He's just a small piece of the show. Wow. <laughs> He's listening to the But deep down inside, yeah. he knows he's more than this. But I see you, <laughs> Kenny, with every passing day. The silence speaks volumes. Wow. Wow. There's so much like more to say. Oh my God. Can you dive into yeah. the lyrics a little bit in case people can hear it? Yeah. No, no, they'll they'll hear it. We'll make sure we have it in. That's crazy. Uh, what was it about? It's basically the corner guy being stuck in the corner and he's coming he's, out. He's coming out of the corner. And you matter. Yeah. Thank you. There's a sick solo. Play the solo at the end. Hang on. Yeah, 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 okay. yeah. This yeah, is yeah, solo. Yeah. <laughs> we did you get a sheer head now. You guys have made me a sheer head. Dude, hey. this is an anthem, man. <laughs> Record this on your own. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, really good. Uh, happy birthday, happy thank you birthday, guys so Kenny. much, happy man. Happy birthday. Yeah. Thank you. Everybody. Brandon hey has a big update. Off the top, and then we'll get into this episode. Hi, mom. Uh, we have for the very special Zars, we have a whole new sticker pack out here wow. now. Let's go, let's go. Um, Can you identify who you are? Oh, my name is Brandon. With the uh, mic closer. <clears throat> my name is Brandon, and I am the merchandise manager here at TMG Studios. Woo! Woo. Uh, my favorite color is purple or blue. And uh, we have a brand new sticker pack out here. Look at this. 
We have amazing artwork yep. on here. Mm -hmm. Amazing from Jim, yep. our illustrator, Ooh, yeah. as well as a special screenshotted tweet from Mr. Beast himself. That's right. That's right. We didn't ask for any permission. Of course. <laughs> ask for permission. Yep. Uh, so we might need Matt to blur out some of these images. <laughs> but uh, and where can they <laughs> uh, where can they find these these things? Oh, where can they find yeah. it at? At shoptmgstudios.com. Wow. Yeah. How much are they? And they're going to be $10. That's not bad at all. Not bad at all. That's great. Yeah. Well, for $10, you're telling me I could get one, two, three, five. Five. Yeah, five. yeah there you go. There you go. <laughs> That's, That's, like $2. That's $2 per sticker. And think about all you can do. Kenny put it on his water bottle. Yeah, I don't have. Oh man, that would have oh, been sweet. Yeah, fuck, fuck, sorry. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> right, Look, I can oh. say I have the Zaw sticker on my water bottle, and I get a lot of compliments on it. Yeah. Um, Thanks, Brandon. They're sweet, man. Yeah. Brandon does a great job yeah. for great us job, here. Brandon. We Thank wanted Brandon some screen time today because he made some amazing stickers for you guys, for us as well. Uh, but they're they're sick. I mean, he didn't make them. He just like put him the artwork. Oh, he put the, the stickiness yeah. on the back oh, of. Grab the, the artwork. Pictures. Then you pull the artwork file. Then you put on some sticky. What material. does Brandon do here? <laughs> Interesting. What does he do actually? Mm, no, he makes good stuff. Uh, he makes merch all across all pods for TV. Uh -huh, uh -huh. So. so if you have any complaints. Go to him. Go to him. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyways. Anyways, welcome to the show. Welcome to the show, Episode guys. 84. Uh, thank you guys for subbing. We hit 2K subs. 2K subs. Yeah. Finally. We're at 2K, 2.12. 2,112, I believe it is. Damn, you're kind of. <laughs> I have not been just refreshing and just uh, hitting the button over and over and over again. But thank you guys for subbing, liking on the pods. That's right. Uh, we had Elise Patton last week. Yep. Who do we have next week? Who? Waleed? Who? Should we say it? Yeah, fuck it. It's just us today. If we, she doesn't come, then we'll cut it. Brittany Broski. Brittany Broski. Brittany Broski next Friday. The queen of the internet, they say. Wow. Yeah. Yes. What are we? Uh, just the, the jesters. <laughs> <laughs> the little jesters. I'm fine okay. with that. Yeah, we have a big <laughs> episode with Brittany. Uh, we also have a Will and Rusty play date that is coming out this Thursday. That's right. That's right. Uh, we did a sit down best friend test. Uh huh. Uh, we also had a vlog that dropped. Um, that was beautifully edited. Oh, yeah. that was one of the best oh, edited yeah. videos it I've ever seen. Sounded to pitch out at all at the, some random parts of the video. Interesting. <laughs> Take it up with Brandon <laughs> for no reason at all. Uh, yeah, that was so sick. That was a sick video. What do you think of that? I I don't remember it actually. <laughs> we went golfing, vlogged that. Uh, we did that for an ad for myself. Yeah. By the way, I've never went. That was my first time ever going golfing, and I get it now. It's fun. It is fun. It is fun. I get like going outside, breathing the fresh air. It's like baseball. Yeah, being white. Yeah, see? <laughs> yeah, that course is right by your house. Yeah, it was very, very... We uh, ran into a Karen. That's right. We had my, our first Karen encounter at the golf course. How was All because of Zach. Because Zach was taking a sweet ass time. I was doing an ad for He was Fireball. doing his videos. Everyone was waiting for the holes. Yeah. And so Zach left his glasses at some hole and he had to drive back with the golf cart. And the Karen goes... Hurry up. <laughs> yeah, she's like, keep up, boys. We're like, we are. Like, we're literally just grabbing the yeah, sunglasses first of all, and she's going. for someone else. Yeah, she's she was behind a person yeah. and then being a Karen. And yeah, it was just Long Beach is this old, retired is, white she people. Was, she was a sick golfer. Yeah, she was good. <laughs> she was fucking crunching it. <laughs> we were hoping that yeah. she would like shank it and then we could be like, yeah, fuck you, bitch. <laughs> I really wanted to say nah, that she was really sick. badly. She was, <laughs> she was so cracked. <laughs> Dude, if we just fucking cuss her out like that. <laughs> Oh, I wanted to cause a scene. But yeah, no, we didn't do that. She was a nice after that lady. But anyways. Were you yep. guys keeping score? What did you shoot? Absolutely not. Okay. We we maybe yeah. played legitimately like two holes. And then oh. uh, it was strictly for my ad. Oh, Because I see. before, uh, my fireball ad, make sure you guys go to my Instagram That's and right, like guys, it. Please, God. Yeah, go to my Instagram. Uh, it's a sick ad, a fireball yep. ad. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The alcohol. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Uh, no, but the first time I shot it, I shot it with my dad, and my dad has no camera skills at all, and it was like a last-minute shoot that I had to do, and my dad, like, I asked him to take a video of me taking the shot, and uh, he just, like, was not looking at me, and he was just holding it like this, <laughs> and then I was out of frame, so that was one shot wasted, and I drank it, 
<laughs> and then the second one, he held the camera like a like it was a picture, and he just like didn't do any like cool movements or anything <laughs> like that. He just held it really still, and I drank it out of frame, and I came back in frame. Like he didn't follow me at all. Anyway, the whole point of the ad. Is yeah. So I sent out. that to them, and they were like, "Yeah, this sucks." <laughs> And I was like, I know, but I had to send a rough draft due date. So. What is a real experience for your dad? Be like, so this is what you do? Yeah, bro. <laughs> it was really awkward. And the ad was me punching a punching bag thing and then like revealing the fireball shot. And I had to do that with my dad sitting next to me. And my dad, like, he was like, we have to do this now? Like, we're golf. Like, my dad was taking the day seriously, like, yeah. golfing. And he's like, we, we're golfing. Like, and we had, we were paired with two other random white dudes, uh, older white guys. And they obviously don't get what the fuck I'm doing. Yeah. So I was punching. I had a punching bag, like, in the golf cart. And it was just, like, weird. Like, obviously, it's not suitable for golf. And, uh, but yeah. So I had to reshoot that bad boy. Can I ask you something? When you, does your dad, like, watch your content? Does he understand? Like the dance bits and, and all that no. shit that you do? No. He doesn't watch any. He's still, he's subbed to my YouTube. So sometimes he'll get emails like when I drop a YouTube video. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So uh, he, he knows That's my dad sweet. jokes, my yeah. in, incest dad jokes where I fuck. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, where I fuck my dad. Yeah, he watches <laughs> I those. I remember those. <laughs> he goes, these are weird. <laughs> like, <laughs> Why are you making me sound like this? Oh, Dad, you yeah. remember our childhood? Come on! I give you a very loving childhood, actually. I don't oh, know where you go. <laughs> Great dad. <laughs> yeah. Well, we'll eat. Kenny, we all know I'm balding, especially in the back. We have that bald cam that's up above us that always spotlight. Okay, anyways, but I started taking Nutrafol. My hair is getting thicker. It's getting stronger. It's getting healthier. So I'm looking a little better. I think so. My wife says so. So I'm just gonna go ahead and agree with that. Nutrafol is the number one dermatologist recommended hair growth supplement with over 1 million people seeing thicker, stronger, faster, growing hair with less shedding. Your hair is never just about your hair and Nutrafol knows that. That's why Nutrafol takes a whole body approach to hair health, addressing the problems inside to help hair growth on the outside, supporting your lifestyle, not just your hairstyle. Physician formulated with drug-free ingredients, Nutrafol's hair growth supplements are clinically tested to multi-target key root causes of thinning, including stress, nutrition, and lifestyle. Nutrafol has multiple formulas that are tailored to give your hair what it needs to grow throughout different stages, such as aging and parenting, as well as for different lifestyles, such as plant-based diets. With Nutrafol, building a hair growth routine is simple. Purchase online, no prescription or doctor visits required, Free shipping and automated deliveries ensure you never miss a day. See results in three to six months. Take the first step to visibly thicker, healthier hair. For a limited time, Nutrafol is offering our listeners $10 off your first month subscription and free shipping when you go to Nutrafol.com and enter the promo code ZAS. Nutrafol.com spelled N-U-T-R-A-F-O-L.com promo code ZAS. That's Nutrafol.com promo code ZAS. But yeah, so that was fun. Just painting him to be like the worst person ever. <laughs> yeah. He feels about it. Uh, yeah, he doesn't watch my vids. Um, he didn't go to my wedding. I don't know if you guys knew that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, my dad didn't go to my wedding. Damn, he and I have something in common. Yeah, okay. That's yeah. Wild. yeah. <laughs> hey, we got dark humor all around. <laughs> hey. <laughs> uh, it was just like my parents. I almost didn't go, by the way. <laughs> Thanks, dude. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's my vibe. <laughs> it's, what do you mean? Uh, <laughs> Had to be the, what was it, the groomsman? Ugh. Yeah, yeah, Too many yeah. people looking at you. You had a lot of responsibility. Yeah. By the way, I was in the last line. Should I have been in the front of the groomsman line? Oh, it was by color. Oh. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. Was, the guy in the front was very pale. <laughs> it was, yeah, a color scheme. Okay, okay. Yeah, All the yeah, way yeah, down. Yeah. JJ, Tots' mm-hmm. brother. Yeah, little tan. Right before you. Yep, yeah. yep, See? yep, yep. Yeah, all right, yeah. That's a good way to do it. <laughs> but yeah, my parents hate each other. So they didn't want to go, to, or my dad didn't want to start a fight at my wedding, so he just didn't go. And I was like, okay, that's fine. But how? What would he say? Fuck you from far away, dude. Yeah, I mean, well, they were supposed. To, you're supposed to walk down with each other. Oh. So they would be like punching behind my back. <laughs> like, fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, fuck you. <laughs> you didn't pay the lawyer bills. Fuck you. <laughs> like, guys, 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 please. It's the biggest day of my life. Smiling the whole time. Like, yeah, that's my parents. But yeah, um, it's all good. Kenny, when is your wedding? 
Uh, we don't have a date yet, but we we're talk about this every spring. time. Oh, yeah, yeah. Doesn't have one. I, yeah, I'm so lame because I don't have any updates when you guys ask. I, we've been dragging our feet on that. <laughs> well, so. we'll just don't worry about it for our best yeah, man yeah. proposal. Uh, it's not. Yeah, a- who are you gonna pick out of the two of us? Oh man, <laughs> so many decisions to make, so many things to weigh, pros and cons. You can literally just flip a coin. Yeah. What yeah. if you pick someone random like Cody? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's how he got the job, dude. Huh? It's not that random. <laughs> oh shit, my bad. <laughs> He's known Cody longer. I do have a lot of white guys, so maybe you know. Maybe oh, color scheme. Yeah, yeah color scheme. Yeah, it's a really good way to go with the, the groomsmen. Yeah. It shows that you're not racist. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, I had to throw you in. Yeah. 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 Before oh, we do vows, yeah. Yeah. I'd like to just state that I am not racist. <laughs> as Exhibit you, A. As you can see from my friend group. Yeah, I had uh, notes for the videographer to like highlight you in the video for like yeah. every once in a while just to show like some. Splice it in. Yeah. There's just shots of me eating. Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> like, you're like asking the videographer, like, why are you just on me the whole fucking time? Is it five <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, to close the loop on the cool stuff we've been shooting lately and things we have coming up, we shot part of a sketch that we're going to be releasing oh, next, within yes. this month, I think. Yeah, we're yeah. still cooking on it, yeah. but very exciting. Do we, I don't know if we want to say any details, but we, we had some fun shoots for that. Do you guys know Hive Mind? No, actually. Uh, <laughs> we shot mind? a video. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right. <laughs> uh, yeah, we shot a, a sick skit with them. So we've had two pods with them before, and they went swimmingly mm-hmm, well. Mm-hmm. Uh, but this time, we switched up the medium. We should just keep hyping shit up like this and just like lie. Like uh, SpaceX. Oh yeah, well that was uh, that was supposed <laughs> to happen. <laughs> what happened with SpaceX? Did it was, it like, they wa- they, the way they wanted it was like delivery. Enter this conversation a little smoother. What the fuck? Was okay. <laughs> for, people, <laughs> for people I don't know, you were. Oh yeah, we're gonna SpaceX. cater for SpaceX, but they wanted it done in a delivery way, and the car's just not set up like that right now. Yeah, yeah. To yeah. do like Uber Eats essentially. So Elon almost fucked you. Yeah, he almost fucked me. But listen, I don't mind. <laughs> you, you literally that's your lord and savior bro. i don't mind take my body <laughs> put a chip in it <laughs> i'm put, just a hole put hey, some ads do whatever you want put some ads in the chip i don't give a damn <laughs> they didn't w- they didn't want the minion live on the lot oh no that'd be a hazard <laughs> <laughs> that would be a hazard or something uh by the way i'm gonna sue you for that what the minions mm-hmm. oh yeah so guys they made a minions costume full like universal studios it's very well done but the rig inside to put the minions on is just a little janky. And so when I shot the photos with the minions, I had Zach put it on. I didn't tell him that he was going to put it on. Nope, just... he didn't. I was coming to help you shoot videos for your, <laughs> your minion shoot. And then he goes, ah, by the way, uh, you mind just putting it on for the video? <laughs> and I'm like... Oh yeah, sure, dude. <laughs> it's a, it's only a fifty pound costume. Yeah, but there's a fucking fat metal bar on my <laughs> head, and I'm like, I'm literally like this, like just <laughs> dancing, and I still have a bump on the back of my head. You know, <laughs> and the whole time I'm like, uh, the person that was uh, that made it. You, yeah, Eris. Eris. Um, they were like, uh, oh, you, uh, we'll we'll put something there. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. And I was like, no, it's like really bad. Like, <laughs> you should put it on. Like, you should definitely put it on because they were saying that it's like, oh, we'll think about it. Yeah, like, yeah maybe yeah, 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 yeah. if you strap it in, it should yeah, be, it'll fine. be a lot easier. Yeah. yeah. I was like, no, you should definitely do it because <laughs> I have a fucking bump now on the back what of my head. What are you going to do? Sue me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you're going to show this as evidence? You can't even tell you're wearing it. Can you? What is the purpose of this? Uh, just the same as the last one, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You and your marketing stuff. Because you yeah. came up with this idea a while ago, and yeah. then you had it made. Cust- you had customized. Custom made, just like the Schwarm yeah. machine, yeah. And then okay. the idea is to uh, keep making more of these, and at the end, they all come together as one big happy family. Yeah. So after this wow. is Hookah SpongeBob. And then. <laughs> and uh, again, for like the eighth thousand time, like when Waleed says this. It's, it's happen. happening. It's happening. Look, there it is. <laughs> People in the comments are like, oh, this is actually like real. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Are you going to have Zach jump into this one oh, too? <laughs> oh, no. I'll probably put this one on. <laughs> yeah. yeah, this was kind of fun. This one's going to look soft. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Old, wrinkly, so then washed up SpongeBob. I'm making this one. And then, yo, yo, was real quick is yeah. I forgot. Somebody knew that you're wearing the costume, right? Mm-hmm. I guess when you commented or whatever. And I saw one of the comments. I, I don't know if it's on this video or another one. Someone said, I never knew I needed this, but a Zach and Waleed podcast, uh, Zach and Waleed collab is like m- 
Like, finally it happened. And I was like, what? What the fuck? I was like, what do you mean? You, you never knew we'd do anything together? <laughs> it's like the person wrote the comment, like, as if we just linked up. <laughs> this is how we come back? Yeah. I never knew I needed a Zach and Waleed collab. I was like, what the fuck? Dude, we should do a pod where you're in the shawarma machine outfit and I'm in the minion costume. <laughs> and we're just doing the pod like that. Just like this alpha male pod. That'd be sick. I'm down. <laughs> That'd be great. Yeah. I'm running out. After Hookah Spongebob, I don't know what else to do. Is the Hookah Spongebob going to be like a styrofoam outfit? I think so, yeah. It's going to have the couch. It's going to have actual hookah. And these are all tax write-offs. Of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. According They're to all my guy. Expenses. Huh? They're all business expenses. Yeah, yeah, yeah. sure. They're marketing tools. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Can you go into your marketing scheme again? Because like, you put in a lot of money into these items, right? Yeah. Okay, this is how it works. You put a lot of money in, you don't get a lot of money back. Okay. <laughs> but if you think Period. about it, it's the <laughs> return on investment yeah. of happiness. Yeah. That's where you make your real money. Because, I, I, again, I, I said this before, like, for your swarm machine, really smart, genius yeah. move. You put heavy on the social media side of marketing. Yep, yep, yep. You get, you, this post went very well for you, right? Yep, yep, uh, yep. Twitter went well for you, TikTok. Finally out of the fucking jail. Oh, yeah. T- t- some of your posts are just like, they're really funny. They just, you just get shafted. I think it's, uh, I'm not making enough Chinese content. Ah, yeah, 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 the yeah. Words. I gotta make more Chinese. Yes, yes. That's, that's why <laughs> this shit's not working either is we gotta do more Chinese. <laughs> oh, yeah, we have to just AI <laughs> our voices <laughs> in the Chinese. Or at least Chinese <laughs> subtitles underneath. Yeah, yeah. Um, but you're, your marketing is really good because like you get uh, heavy on the social media front yeah. and then people are excited so this minion is going to be at your next pop-up yep he'll be at the next pop-up and then we're going to try to make- i'm not going to be in the fucking costume oh i was hoping you would i am uh, not doing that dude i have people to serve uh, no no you don't mind wearing it for like an hour right dude. <laughs> an hour two three i just have to serve the f- i have to do the serving in the minion costume <laughs> the mic i have a bow tie yeah like around the minion suit <laughs> 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 you don't mind wearing it for a couple hours come on you're my best friend <laughs> don't pull that card on me <laughs> <laughs> fuck <laughs> that was my last bit <laughs> that was my last card I had <laughs> so you're gonna hire someone to do it yeah I'll hire someone I'll have, like my little cousin or something that, dude, your little cousin would fall over. <laughs> that no, thing is heavy as fuck. I'm one who's like tall as fuck now. Oh, yeah, God, yeah, God. yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a little cousin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm thinking of like, <laughs> like ten years old. <laughs> yeah, uh, you can put this on for two hours with no fan inside. <laughs> <laughs> but you use the minion for Eid. Yeah, it was Eid. Uh, happy Eid, everybody. Eid Mubarak. Yeah. Why do you say that so backhanded? Like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Whatever. Uh, you guys don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Obi's like, I actually passed it. This whole month. Like, oh. oh. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so I had it roll out for Eid, and then eventually I'm going to have it, I don't know when the next date is, but we're going to have it for the next pop-up, and then you could go ahead and meet, um, Brother Bob, I'm calling him. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't see that many, like, good, co- like, people on the shore machine were, like, crushing those comments. Yeah, well, because Brother Bob is kind of new. Mm. Shawar machine already kind of existed. Got it. And it's very, Shawar machine, the thing about Shawar machine is, it was cool because it, was, it fell in line with the hispanic community because mm-hmm. you have al pastor right got it. then you got like the russian community where kebab is very huge over there okay and then you got the middle east so it like fell in like three different cat i swear to god if you look at the comments on the shrine machine tiktok there's like ra- pure russian what the <laughs> yeah, fuck really just pure whatever the language is is just hardcore maybe russian. that's what your new tiktok content needs to be just russian <laughs> <laughs> so that's why it's so good because it, it hit different categories brother bob it only hits one yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? what is that white no American? brown people oh got it yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> i yeah, didn't get yeah. what you were saying <laughs> <laughs> got it okay you have a global vision for your kebab cart, that's what dude. i'm saying <laughs> this man. is crazy but you only stay in la for your car like people have to fly oh from yeah if you gotta come out sorry <laughs> <laughs> i came from russia <laughs> to try this i just wanted a picture with brother bob <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> we're not allowed to have brother bob in russia <laughs> well i'm trying to think think about like mr bean right Mr. Bean. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. He, you could, you, anyone could watch Mr. Bean. Mm-hmm. That's why Schwarm Machine works so well because everyone relates to Schwarm Machine. Brother Bob, yeah, so specific. Do you think I could pull off a Mr. Bean? Oh, kinda? dude, absolutely. He's just a physical comedy character, right? No, it's like, uh, how do you explain? Mis- no, he never talks. Yeah. And he never talks. <laughs> Is that how you explain it? Is no, that you explain no, it? no. Look, he's just fucking. I, you can watch this in a random third world country and be like, yo, this is the funniest shit of my life. Because it's just physical comedy. Yeah, it's just physical comedy. My parents loved it. Oh, nice. Yeah. Nice. And that's Grandma. how I 
my content it just goes viral yeah all this time. is actually the inspo from you know you oh you love jim carrey you love mm -hmm. this is my fucking go <laughs> <laughs> this is why we work so well uh, together look at his tomato score 93 percent. yeah he's crushing Damn. on tomatoes dude that was 100 yeah wow the tomato is 100 oh shit yeah dude that's the amazing the misadventures of a bumbling loner <laughs> mm. uh, sounds yeah. like Kelly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, dude! I actually grew up on Mr. Bean. We had uh, seasons one and two on DVD, and my sisters and I would just play those into the ground. And it's like one of my favorites. Did you guys ever see Johnny English when he played like so. the oh spy James when he's Bond talking in it? No, no, yeah, no, yeah. <laughs> no yeah. talking, no talking, no talking. Yeah. Uh. I wanted to get into Why the did they stop doing Mr. like uh like him fucking not talking and they don't they haven't made like another Mr. Bean movie or anything like that. it's all like Isn't he old now? Yeah. He's a little older, yeah. He's I mean he did so many seasons of it. I think he was just burnt on it. Dude, there's only so many But there's so many relevant have, things like, he could do now. Falling down the stairs, you know. Did you watch the Like him during 9/11 like on the plane? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> like fucking up the nerves so that's not <laughs> <laughs> You know the plane, the plane that landed in a field. Yeah, that was his plane. Yeah. He's like, oh, I missed the building. I was like, Dad, just leave. He's like, oh. God damn it! I would die. I would die laughing if you did that. Now. Yeah, I'd, yeah. It's like, funny to you. No, it doesn't have to be nine eleven. It can be fucking. Uh, yeah, I can picture it now. He's getting up. He's trying to crawl over someone to use the bathroom, <laughs> and then he bumps into the drink cart, sending it into the terrorist. Whoa. The knife goes flying. Yeah, nice. They're able to safely land in Mr. the field. Mr. Bean saved <laughs> nine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Damn, dude. No, every oh every seven thirty seven like accident that's been happening has just been Mr. Bean. Yeah, just yeah, accidentally yeah. Like, he's, all, he's all involved. He opens yeah. the emergency exit. He's like, oh. <laughs> 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 no, it has to start off small first. He has to like open the thing and like some old lady wings fly off. Nice. Like, then that's like the, oh, and then people start flying. Out. <laughs> <He's> like, <laughs> yeah. Everyone that's flying out. He's like trying to hand someone yeah. a parachute. Like, no, no, no. <laughs> yeah. He's putting duct tape. <laughs> has no idea. Uh, dude, the 737 shit is scaring me. I have a couple flights coming. Yeah, up. if anyone has a flight, you should consider driving. <laughs> it's, it's always like the social media always highlights like the bad events that are yeah. happening because there's so many flights that are safe and fine. Yeah, you know what I mean. But like, I feel like there's been it's been very. Uh, <laughs> they're highlighting like yeah, 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 like yeah. a lot of current and they, the the whistleblower too. He's dead now, right? Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Oh, Boeing. Yeah, yeah, there's yeah, some yeah, Boeing. Here, was it? He's an engineer, right? Careful. <laughs> Mr. Bean. Yeah, Mr. Bean has a sniper. <laughs> Sneezes. So I will preface this by saying I don't know anything about this yeah, story. I, I don't know but he that. testified, and I guess they reported that he told his family, if I die, it was not suicide. And then he was found dead. So, damn. Super gnarly. In his car? Yeah, he's found in his car. How? I don't know. Do you know how he died? Yeah. Oh, gunshot uh, in the back of the head. Cause that's um, how you that's how you shoot yourself, right? Yeah, that's yeah. that's the suicide. Yeah, way yeah, go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Damn, it's probably Mr. Bean. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Bean. <laughs> <laughs> Supposed to be the side of the head. He's like playing with the gun. <laughs> Silencer. Yeah. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> He's playing Russian roulette with himself. Yeah. <laughs> oh. You try, you try. <laughs> he gets. <laughs> Oh man, Mr. Bean Gun to see if anything. Uh... Oh my God, he's at the airport. <sighs> oh shit! When was this filmed? Uh, this might be Please the say movie. 2001, <laughs> dude. Unironically, so fucking funny. Please say 2001. <laughs> uh, this no, no, was, I uh... think this is like. Oh, this is the movie. This came out. Yeah. Uh, this came out in like the 90s. I want to 97. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah look, look, he's pretending he has a There's... gun. Yeah, he's like, I'm gonna do 9/11. Which the scene is so good because now everyone glorifies like grabbing police guns and shit. Oh, <laughs> oh shit. he's like, gun. How did you know that? Did you watch this movie? Yeah, I watched this movie. It's so good. Oh, I didn't know. I don't remember like, anything. Like he loves idea. <laughs> like I'm looking at him. <laughs> <laughs> he's landing in LA to kill the whistleblower. <laughs> and they're like, oh shit. <laughs> 
<laughs> dude. <laughs> All right, All we're right. probably gonna get copyrighted on that. Mr. Bean, what a um, legend. Yeah. <laughs> well, you want? Uh, why don't you play the other AI song that you had? Getting going back into your kebab cart. You had oh, no, Bob? that one's not good enough. That was great. No, it's not ready yet. It's not ready yet. Are you gonna actually use it? Nah, maybe for a commercial. I'm gonna make it sound like more like a jingle. So there's this AI app. You actually log into it. Type into uh, so it's it's really easy. You just go to your social and S U N O, um, AI. Yeah, there you go. And then, so basically, you can set you could write any prompt you want, right? Yeah. And then it'll just make a full song. You can tell it in the style. You can tell it if you want to rock. You can tell it if you want a piano. Okay, for for Kenny's birthday song. Yeah. You said that you were working really hard on Because you have to get the prompt really... You have to get the prompt... Like, it's hard to write prompts. It's hard. I hate AI so much, bro. So I would write something, then put it in chat GBT, and then pull it from chat GBT. This is how you're supposed to use fucking AI. What are you typing at right now? Uh, no, no, no. So do this, do this, do this. Say, uh, a, a somber song about how Mr. Bean saved 9-11. Using his funny antics. You know, back in the old days, you have to learn guitar, <laughs> play piano, fucking record on your own shit, get the beat right. Because you were saying you were working out hard. I was like, wait, did you fucking, like, what'd you do? I'm in the stew. I'm in the fucking stew. You see me, like, in a big engineering screen. This is Chad GBT. <laughs> So it's not, you make a song about oh anything. Oh my god! What? The title is the heroic mime. <laughs> That's crazy. Pretty good. I could have came up with that on my own. No, you couldn't. I don't need Can't AI think. for that. Yeah. Okay. Hit play. Okay. Here's the first option. In a world of darkness, sadness, and despair, a tragedy unfolded too heavy to bear. <laughs> This is unreal. In the midst of chaos, confusion, and greed, okay. a hero emerged with no voice to speak. With a twinkle in his eye and a skip in his stride. <laughs> his skip and stride? He stumbled upon the scene where hope had died. Oh my god. With his Damn. funny antics and calm timing, he brought a moment of relief. Wait till the chorus comes in. Oh, I'm waiting. Was so fleeting. Oh, Mr. B. <laughs> with heroic mind, with your silent gestures, you saved us in our time. Saved us what? Saved us in our time. Though the pace still lingers. Alright. That was beautiful. I hate that though. It's so good. It's good. It's great. Damn. Just that's depends, crazy. Just depends on how the same the second one will be the same thing. It just gives you like a different tone. Oh, okay. Yeah. Different uh chorus or whatever. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Really good. Wow. Mm -hmm. I that's hate incredible. that. And you're using that for all you have a couple ads coming out. Yeah, well, you don't have to. You don't have to, Here's the thing: you don't need a fucking background library anymore, a stock library, because you can make instrumentals. What about the people out there who are looking for work? Get a new job, buddy. <laughs> Dude. Sorry, <laughs> robots getting your jobs. Good luck. <laughs> Should have Should have been on, the, not on your ass watching <laughs> Mr. Bean all day. <laughs> what about when your kids are trying to learn guitar and sing? And play and be one day a great musician. Uh, I'll fucking waste your time. <laughs> <laughs> you want to hear a song about Mr. Bean saving 9 11? What the fuck? What do you think? Coding is going to be gone. Coding is going to be like just AI. I think generated. first jobs to go are going to be uh, whoever's listening to this podcast right now, whatever your job is <laughs> currently. <laughs> that's going to be probably the first job that's going to be out of here. And then you're paying for uh, driverless Tesla. Yeah, then you got your robo taxis, and then you got. Uh, Tell people how much a fucking driverless Tesla is. Oh, so for the software is twelve thousand dollars. That's insane. And then to, for month per month is two hundred bucks. 
Wait, you have to pay a subscription? Yeah, you have to pay a subscription. Why is everything subscription based now? But the, car, dri- the car drives itself. Yeah, I know. Uh, think, yeah, about I know. A, think about it. You already driver. paid twelve grand. <laughs> and then they want more on top of that no, every no, month. Either you pay twelve or you pay two hundred. Dude, it's hella oh, funny. Okay. We were we were in what leads Tesla on a way to like dinner or whatever, and it was driverless on Melrose. And Melrose, if you don't know, is like cars are fucking yep. parallel parking in the middle of the street yep. and people are just jaywalking and blah blah blah. And we were like in the back seat and while he's doing the driver list he's like all right guys let's see if it does it and there's like people just like scootering in the middle of the road and he scoots past he goes whoo that was close <laughs> and, I'm like, <laughs> and i'm like he's like oh man that was good and we're like yeah that's how you should be driving dude like well, the car did it it's crazy <laughs> the car didn't kill him that's how it should go <laughs> You don't know these things when these things first come out. There's horror accidents. <laughs> <laughs> That's the scary part is I did the free trial. So they're giving everyone a free trial and I did it. And I'm like, oh, am I just a fucking test rat right now? <laughs> you are. But it was like, it was funny. We, we saw them scootering like far ahead. He's like, all right, guys, this is a test. Here we go. <laughs> and we're like, just like, we, we just couldn't control it. Like, we just literally had to make sure that. Well, I had my hand on the wheel. Okay, yeah, worse. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But the people sure. don't know that I'm. <laughs> yeah. The, the people just freely just like listening to Mr. Bean, like in their ears, like. Do, do, do. Like, we listen to anything <laughs> from down the street. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sure. But like, they were just like not, you know, minding their own business. And we're just coming up with a Tesla going like 40 miles an hour like all right guys well let's make sure that we don't hit these people I, and like, oh, you should wear a helmet <laughs> you're fucking up my test <laughs> it was elon uh, you fucking up the test man uh 12 what is it Twelve thousand dollars for that yeah you get the if you buy it outright it's like 12 grand and then if you do it monthly it's 200 bucks a month damn yeah but the way you sleep in your car can you write that off Oh yeah, actually. I'm just thinking about taxes because I was. I How do you convince I, the IRS that you're using the time to to do work? It's saving lives, <laughs> so it should be a write-off. <laughs> <laughs> more taxes for you guys. Yes, with more people working yes. in the lives. Yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, dude, you're for sure getting audited. <laughs> more money in your pockets. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um. Can you guys explain to me? What happened with this TikTok Riz party? Because I'm I purposefully stayed away from it so that you can. Explain I have it. also purpose. This is the stupidest no, fucking no, thing no, no, ever. No, 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 no. Let me tell. <laughs> let me explain it. All right. It it was a party that was. I think it was a prom or like a uh, a bar mitzvah. Maybe? High schoolers. <laughs> so it's a bunch of kids having a good old time. Mm-hmm. The bunch of videos come out right, mm-hmm. and then. People start over, they called it the Riz Party, the, which the flyer is fake. It was never called the Riz Party. It was probably just called like prom or something. Or yeah. Shit like that. Benny's right? Bar Mitzvah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and then it like blew up and then everyone started over analyzing every single one of these kids like body language uh, to the point where they gave every single one of these guys nicknames. So the guy in the leader and then the, and the blue tie is the leader. Are you sure about yeah, that? Yeah, they call him. They call him the leader. Are you sure right? about that? The well, guy in the white is called uh, Tomato Boy, and he's second in command, right? No. Now. Yeah, that's not Tomato Boy. Yeah, Tomato Boy's in the white. I thought it was one of the dudes who has rosy red cheeks. That's Tomato Boy. No, 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 no. <laughs> I bet you it is, dude. Play it. Yeah. I'll tell you which one's Tomato Boy. Tomato Boy is rosy red cheeks guy. The guy with the blue tie. I'm pretty sure. No, 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 no. Tomato Boy's in the white. This is how it all went viral, is people just fucking debating this shit. Was, so they overanalyzed the body language, and then even the, the brown kid, they called them, they, they all gave these guys names. So the brown kid's called Turkish Guandale Dingle. Okay. <laughs> so funny, bro. No, it's not funny. <laughs> Hilarious. It's not, it's not funny at all. Grow up. No, no, no. It's not, it's not funny. I don't think it's funny, actually. <laughs> this is a meme for nine-year-olds. I don't I don't, get no, it. it's not. Look, that brown kid is my representation, mm-hmm. all right? Of high school parties? No, not of high school. Listen, as a, uh, a kid, you know, I didn't get invited to these things. <laughs> so to see him have a good time. So which one are you? The Turkish Quandale Dingle. Wait, but which you can't even dance. Which one's Quandale Dingle? Oh, he co- he's coming. Oh, he's coming. Oh, he hasn't play? shown up yeah. yet? He hasn't shown up Maybe yet. he doesn't even show up in this. Oh, he's the kid in the back, the little brown one. <laughs> oh, this guy? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's Quandale Dingle? Uh-huh. Turkish Quandale. We oh, got to Tur- get his excuse me. ethnicity right. <laughs> okay. Right? That kid is my representation, and I'm very proud of him. <laughs> and they're having fun. They're, they love all the shit that's coming afterwards. They're making jokes about it. 
it's, g- it's gonna get to their heads it's gonna be another fucking gen z like fucking takeover is this fucking riz party it's so fucking stupid no, it's, dude. Not. it's not just because you're old and you're washed i don't give a fuck <laughs> this is the stupidest fucking shit ever no it's sick bro it's sick. click kids, on some of my links that kid, I kids this. having a good time that's stupid to you why is it going viral though just because people were debating the hierarchy of the fucking party who cares let <laughs> them fucking dance out. Want to point out on our talking point stock, while he added a bullet point, just says kids having fun. Because <laughs> that's what it was. It was kids having a good time. Why right? is it going so viral then? Okay, here. Oh, here's uh, Turkish Quandale Dingle. So okay, we can't. Place- I want to preface my part of this. Mm-hmm. All right. So Walid has been using this for his kebab cart, uh, promoting it like for memes and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, I made one meme. No, yeah, I'm just saying like you were using it. It's it's a, a viral moment that was happening. You're using it to uh, use some merch and some posts and stuff yeah. like that. Fair enough. Fine. But then I'll, he was like trying to show me. He's like, what do you think of this is for the kebab cart post? I was like, I don't. What is this? He's like, oh, it's the tur- it's like the <laughs> yeah, whatever the fuck it is. And I was like, K. Okay. He's like, dude, it's sick. You got to fucking watch this shit. And I'm like, no, I don't really want to do that. And he's like, all right, man, you're going to miss the boat on this. And then so then all of a sudden now, as of last night on the dock, you had like all the links or whatever for the Turkish Quandale yeah. Dingle. Then all of a sudden I see on my TikTok feed. Four posts in a row <laughs> of fucking Turkish Quandale Dingle. And guess who's reposting all of them? Turkish Quandale Dingle. <laughs> it's not you that was reposting him on TikTok. Guess who was reposting who? him? Nut. Oh, for real? Nut has reposted four of the videos. I was like, why are these all on my feed? It's like Young Nut repost, Young Nut repost, <laughs> Young Nut repost. So I thought it was you that was like, uh, uh-uh. that's how you got it from. But this is how the whole hierarchy started. Uh, please, go ahead. I still yeah, think yeah. this shit This one also has no audio. Okay. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, it's going to have music. That's what I mean. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. It's okay, so this is the walkthrough. Tomato Boy is the guy in the fucking back. See? This kid? Yeah, yeah, yeah the yeah, long okay. hair. That's what I was saying. Oh, for someone who doesn't uh, care about it. I just <laughs> wanted to get the story right that to know, Tomato uh, Boy was the one in the back. Seems like someone relates <laughs> to Tomato Boy a little bit. Because I get rosy red cheeks <laughs> yeah. and I sweat a fuck ton when I dance. <laughs> <laughs> I also relate to Tomato Boy. Oh, yeah. here, uh, you oh here's, here's the... Something. Okay, yeah, we yeah, should have yeah, started yeah. with this. So this breaks oh, down the hierarchy. maybe I linked it. Uh, yeah, maybe yeah, yeah, I yeah. should start this story pretty Wait, good. I think you played yeah. the volume. No, it has music. Okay. This one has music? Yeah. Okay, so this is going to explain the hierarchy. Of yes. It. Okay. Right. You have to verbally walk them through. Okay, okay. the full hierarchy. Tomato Boy, oh, you're right. He is the rosy red cheek. Boom, bitch. So he's at the bottom of the pyramid. So who's the backup? TRP runs smoothly under... Okay. This is happening really fast. Maybe okay, you can play number that. three is White Shirt Kid. That's a good name for him. I thought that was number two. No, no, he's on three because number two is Turkish Quandale Dingle. So no, he, number two is not Turkish Quandale Dingle. I'm pretty sure. Oh, think they think so. that White Shirt's going to be the successor. Oh, it is Turkish Quandale. Yeah. Damn. Okay. Yes. Damn, 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 damn. See, See diversity, bro. Turkish. <laughs> so- <laughs> it's fucking diversity. <laughs> Dude, that, they're, they're going to teach the spirit Arabic. tongue technique. Zach, can we see the spirit tongue te- technique? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sitting. It would, hang on. I'll stand up for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Damn, dude. Oh, he's going to be You might be next in line. Yeah, you Pretty might good. be next in line. The hierarchy, dude. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And then the leader is the Thai the guy. The blue Thai kid, yeah. He possesses a unique charisma. See, look, he's doing interviews now. So my analysis of this yeah. is the reason why he's hierarchy is I think lip singing is it lip singing or lip syncing? Sinking. Sinking. Lip yeah, syncing. Yeah. Thank you. Is um actually like a, a very good skill to have. Yeah. And it carries you well. Yeah. In yeah, life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chari- and that it, guy has charisma. Yep. He's got the lip syncing skill. Yep, yep. He yep. can dance. He's got swag. Yep. He's gotta have a good life. And perhaps he has riz. <laughs> Oh my God, Zach! And actually, I'm glad he's on the top of the hierarchy <laughs> because Tomato Boy had no dance moves. That's right. No Riz. That's right. Rosy red cheeks. Way too much sweat, and no bitches. Listen, Tomato Boy. <laughs> tomato Boy. It's it. Tomato Boy. <laughs> tomato Boy. Uh, it's Jover for you, buddy. Bye. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. We're trying to hit all the memes. <laughs> yeah. We're trying to hit all the the Gen Z memes that we can uh, we can do. <laughs> or uh dude, I saw I saw so this is embarrassing. Mm-hmm. 
Fortnite has a Avatar the Airbender collab coming out. Nice. It's pretty sick. I don't know if you guys are into that kind of stuff, <laughs> <laughs> but it's like kind of cool, I guess. Nice, nice. Yeah, 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 yeah. I had no idea. And so, uh, Airbender Avatar the Last Airbender. And so you all know the fifth edition. Yeah, you all know <laughs> the intro where it's like uh, air, water, fire, like the intro of the show. Nope. You never seen the intro for yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So let me send you a link real quick. <laughs> <laughs> I still have. Uh, I'm only on. Um, I I have not even rewatched any anime. I've given up because it's baseball season, baby. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Unless well, they made an anime about baseball. Is there an anime about baseball? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> too lame <laughs> what is this so it's in line it's just like i don't know they basically remade the intro <laughs> just and then play the volume you can play the volume on this one yeah tax collector long ago the four this is real lived together in harmony but everything changed when the skibbities attacked Dude. Only the Sigma, Whoa. master of all Rizzlers, could stop them. But when the world needed him the most, the Phantom taxed. A hundred years passed, and my brother Dude, and I discovered what is your Sigma, fucking algorithm? a tax collector named Aang. And although he has W Riz, he still has a lot to pay for tax. But I believe Aang can save Ohio. Ohio? Right, you can pause it, you can pause it, you can pause it. You can it. What is your algorithm? That's great, that's so funny. So this got you hyped up for the... No, no, this is unreal. I just... They, it's been trending now because the collab's coming out. Mm -hmm. And that showed up on my feed. And it's also in line with the Riz Party stuff. And so I thought it was very, very... It was art. If you had your own solo podcast, I really like your fucking topics. Which is <laughs> like, watch this sick TikTok. <laughs> it's just like everyone's like... And then explaining the what Phantom Tax <laughs> yeah, is. <dude>. <laughs> <laughs> so Phantom Tax, guys, is it's really important to think about. If you actually accumulated like a niche audience who just like gets the same videos you do, <laughs> that actually be hella funny. Um, uh. Do you want phantom taxes? No. <laughs> Here, pull up, pull up this TikTok. Okay. Pull up this TikTok. No, 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 you have to pull it up. The I phantom know. Rizzler is a tax collector. <laughs> uh, it's basically Kai Snet's roommate, right? Oh my god! And anytime Kai's eating, he comes into the room. Takes a bite and his name is Phantom, so he gets he Phantom taxes your food. Toby said, "Ah, on May first. Yeah, how old are you turning? Thirty. Damn. <laughs> yeah, what's wrong with that? You, <laughs> <laughs> I don't get it. Why? Uh, I just want to, you know, make sure, yeah. that, like, uh, you know, your algorithm. You know, Gia is. <laughs> 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 you ever heard of a Gia? <laughs> You guys want a phantom tax and birthday cake? I would love to. Oh yeah, yeah. phantom tax. Yeah, yeah. Bring it over. I, so I had a great story with this bad yeah. boy. Uh, yesterday at six p.m., I I put this order in at Pavilions. Okay. Um, the guy. Oh wow. Uh, how are we? Thank just yeah yeah yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, dude. The guy at Pavilions didn't really spoke very 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 broken English. Yeah. Uh, I was given my phone number, the order, everything. Yeah, no riz. <laughs> okay. <laughs> if you're at fucking like family parties or like family gatherings and your grandma, yeah, you, you haven't pull, talked to pull so yeah. 30, 30, my grandma. I'm like, yeah, grandma, so I had no riz this week, but I'm really, I'm picking myself up the, uh, once I achieve level 10 Gia, I should be good. <laughs> like, having a full conversation. <laughs> my grandma just has a stroke. <laughs> So she, from a 30 year old telling her this <laughs> you're just like she thinks her new name like it's no grandma's like skidaby or whatever yeah, the fuck yeah, he says yeah, like yeah. so skidaby uh, I'm know, sure the avatar thing I'm like yo <laughs> <laughs> she's like what the fuck is my grandma I'm saying drinking? it in Farsi too I'm saying it in a different language <laughs> <laughs> oh man okay anyways I put this order in yesterday right uh, the dude had like very, very broken English. I was being very patient with him. Um, I, cause I, you know, I wanted to get this right. I didn't really care if it turned out okay. Cause I thought it was funny. I, you know, it was just corner guy. Dude, it turned out great, man. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. But, it was for a bit. It's not real, really yeah. good. Yeah. But like when he was going through like what the cake was, I was just like, sure, sure. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Whatever, whatever. 
but when i had to give my number uh he was like very slow please very very slow and i was like okay nine two five like that and he's like no 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 like slow 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 and i was like okay so i was like nine two like that still fucked nine, up nine <laughs> nine as in nine yeah. <laughs> nine as in skiddy yeah. like, oh, oh, oh yeah. <laughs> I didn't know you had Riz yeah, yeah. <laughs> in Spanish yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay anyways so then so he fucked up the number after I went through it like multiple times with him Fair enough. I was like, we got it right. And then uh, he asked for my name. I said my name like multiple times. Long story short, I go to the thing. I was like, order for Zach. They're like, oh, no, we have an order for Isaac. And I was like, oh, God, that's probably me. And then Toss found out that I probably said uh, Zach like that. Uh, and so- <laughs> that's fair. I know, yeah. That's totally I said fair. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's totally fair, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so I said uh, Zach like that, and he thought Isaac. Fair enough. Totally fair. But then when I said corner guy, I went through that spelling like fucking like a sloth, bro. Yeah. I was like C. Oh. C as in C. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like that. And uh we went through that many times and I get there and and she says, "Oh, it says comer guy." <laughs> and I was like, yeah, I was like that's kind of funny, but like she's like, we could fix it. I was like, all right, fine. please. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But I also give him the benefit of the doubt. The o- the R mixing with the N on frosting could look like an yeah. M. So it could have been corner guy still, but yeah, yeah, it just yeah. looked like comer guy. So That's you're hilarious. You're dude. a comer guy, I'm baby. Comer guy, dude. Yeah, yeah, brother. <laughs> Shooting the ropes over here. Hell yeah. <laughs> All the phone like C as in C. <laughs> over inflate it. Yeah. But he, it was a good guy. Yeah. R as in Riz. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Do we have any forks or anything, or are we just going to fucking uh, finger this? I don't see any. I don't We can have eat any. it later. I it's just okay. want to say thank you, man. That's so nice. Yeah, That's dude. Really. That's that's so cool. Thank you for doing well, that. Well, he was going to have you like come up, and we're like, we actually kind of need him to be in the corner. Oh, yeah. like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> we're like, we actually need him to, you know. Stay the there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It breaks the lore if I come out of the corner. Kenny, this is your time. Uh, how do you feel about turning 31? It's, uh, it's weird, man. I think uh, a lot of people say that when you turn 30, you kind of have, uh, you, you don't really worry about turning 30 anymore once yeah. you're 30, but yes. like- <laughs> I feel like, I, I don't know, I feel like I'm still thinking about it a lot. I'm still like, oh, fuck, I'm 31 now, and I yeah. I don't know, there's just things I want to do and all that shit. I don't know how you feel, Waleed, but I don't know. I, I, mean, I don't feel <laughs> great about it. Uh, I feel like it should be apparent, like pretty apparent that I'm not stressed when I'm talking about TikTok. Or yeah. <laughs> You're still the same Seriously? guy. Seriously? You're yeah. literally, like, I don't you think I'll, I don't think I'll, anything will change. I think I'll just be more conscious of what I'm saying. Nice. Mm-hmm. You're gonna talk about Riz parties more eloquently. Yes, exactly. Mm. More scientific. Yes. Uh, breakdown. Yes, yeah, so a Riz party. <laughs> By 31, I thought I'd be next in line, but I still think I'm a tomato <laughs> boy. <laughs> <laughs> you still got a long way to go, buddy. Yeah. Walid had a. There's like a family birthday party for Walid's 30th, but he doesn't want to do it because he doesn't think that he should be celebrating his birthday. I don't want to celebrate my birthday at 30. It's just a weird, sad age. Um. <laughs> yeah, totally, dude. <laughs> uh, but I wanted to have a TikTok Riz party. Yeah, 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 yeah. That'd be so funny. Everyone pulls up. It's like themed. It's themed like that. <laughs> Quandale Dingle. Dingle. Yeah, it's like a big poster. You like cycle through like your people. Like, eh, you're not good. You, yeah, you don't yeah. fit this hierarchy here. Uh, Tomato Man. Yeah, come on, come on, come on. I like have Spotify like all the songs that they play. <laughs> Uh, are you doing anything for your birthday? Uh, no, I don't have any plans right now. Actually, I'm just I'm not I like I'm like Walid. I don't really have big aspirations for my birthday. I like just chilling. Although for my thirtieth, I did kind of rent out a corner section of a bar corner, in line corner, with guy. corner guy, and I had a bunch of my friends come out. We drank a bunch, and uh, but this year I think I'm just gonna keep it mellow, man. Might see if there's any Riz parties last minute. <laughs> yeah. You can, dude, Kenny, get a front row seat at a bar today. Yeah? yeah, yeah, you think so? Yeah. yeah, get out of that corner of the bar, <laughs> dude. Uh, <laughs> Sit at the bar top. Step up into the light. <laughs> yeah, which dude. by the way, we want to shoot a music video with that song for you. 
The the wrist party? No, yeah. the, the oh, oh the one the, the song, song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Let's Bas- do it, dude. Basically, will be very dark, cinematic. Yeah, we'll, we'll do a bunch of shots when you're on everyone's podcast. Maybe we'll do a shot of like you on insanely chill. You trying to say <laughs> something and Cody just like oh, because <laughs> you know he's good at that face. He already yeah, yeah, does yeah, that. Yeah. Right. Oh what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, dude. Well, yeah. Thanks again, boys. That's that means a lot. Uh, I I've never felt prouder to be a corner guy. Hell yeah. Right now, yeah. So. It was funny because <laughs> you were looking at the dock house light and you're like probably thinking like oh this is empty as fuck. We're like ah don't you worry don't about you it. Worry. Big guy. We got some surprises. We got about five minutes covered <laughs> already on <laughs> top. Yeah. We got some surprises <laughs> for you, buddy. Yeah. I will say it was kind of weird like last night I'm like usually we're texting about the episode a little more by now but, but. <laughs> no we text about it days ahead oh yeah 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 yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. this is a planned yeah. ep good to go um I also wanted to check in on your fitness updates, Zach. You care? Yeah, I care. You see me eating this cake? No, I haven't touched. I haven't even looked at that Damn. cake. Nope. I don't yeah. give a fuck about this cake. I, about that cake. I think I'm pretty hot. Oh, dude, I did a my first body reveal on my Snapchat. What? Did you? Why? That's right. I still post on Snap a lot, by the way. Yeah. And I love it. But it's an app that I don't really give a fuck about. So every day I post my workouts. I do like, oh, nice. Oh, God. Wait, we're fitness updates. Oh, we? shit. <laughs> so you're going through your update? Kenny, you should have the first <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. I'll be right there. Um, but yeah, I post my body updates or my workout updates on uh-huh. my Snapchat. I just do workout one, workout two, workout three, and I got, I'm all the way up to workout 68 as of yesterday. So yeah, yeah, yeah. So, but I did my first shirtless body reel where I covered my nipples and I just like, I showed my body for the first time. Yeah. And I was really nervous. And all the comments were, uh, this work, this looks like workout number one. Keep oh. going. And then it was like, dude, I thought you were going to be more ripped than this. And I was like, all right. Okay. I- <laughs> yeah. Dude, that's so fucked. <laughs> Woo. Yeah, dude, so Fuck I was all like, those people, yeah. Dude. yeah, I was. Th- well, you didn't post, did you post before and after? <laughs> no. Well, they have nothing to compare it to. I, I mean, like, I stopped drinking for two months back on that wagon, by the way. Uh-huh. So let's fucking go. <laughs> um, thank you. <laughs> um, but yeah so i i had like a lot of i call them side murfs side muffins mm-hmm. the muffin tops yeah i had those pretty bad but those have been going away because i stopped drinking a little bit i'm watching my drinking now last night i went to el coyote i had one margarita instead of four. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's pretty good yeah <laughs> thank you guys that's great thank man. you thank you oh i didn't drink i haven't been drinking since january i think Damn. Yeah. Wow, dude. Yeah. For real? Yeah. I don't think I've had a... When was the last time I had a... Why are we talking about this? I've been flaunting my two months. I just, I just haven't been thinking about drinking. Got it. Yeah. Just been drinking Diet Coke. Diet Coke is fucking... I know. But the thing is, is like, soda causes cancer. Alcohol causes cancer. So what the fuck? Pick your poison, I guess. Yeah, it's I mean, like... both. <laughs> Mix it up. <laughs> Can I have a diet, uh, vodka uh, Diet Coke, yeah. please? I mean, everything gives us, dude, this shit. Uh, yeah. The mic. Yes. Something about the mic. <laughs> Teslas. Yep, yep, yep. Watches yep. on your wrist. Putting your phone in your pocket. Phone in the pocket. You, yo, testicular you, cancer. You feel like it, it did? I, I know for a fact it did. I, I don't know. I'm... Whoa, 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 whoa. That's a huge claim to make. 85% sure because yeah. it happened during COVID. I didn't have a, a working desk during work. Yep. And so I kept it on. I worked on the couch and I had a laptop on my on my balls. Oh. Yeah. And I heated up. I felt it every single time. Yeah. Cause I the, thought it felt nice. So I was like, oh, this is like laughing. a little ball koozie. You know, like a little fucking... <laughs> Now it turned into a ball cube. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So. Or uh, you ever sleep with your phone under the pillow? Yep. Did I that. Stopped, I stopped doing that. Nice. Yeah. I tried to. I don't charge my phone at night anymore. Because I feel the 5Gs when I wake up. Nice. Yeah. I, I, I mean, I have a little weird theory. I think my chemotherapy like made me feel like radiation a lot more from like different like... A little tinfoily of me, but yeah. I honestly feel like my chest sometimes, like when I charge my phone right next to me, I feel like my chest get tingly. <laughs> I swear to God. No, no, no. I'm not joking about what you're saying. I just imagine. Maybe some Riz no, joke. No, 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 no. no. No, 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 no. I'm just imagining <laughs> you, like, you have some weird radiation effect where, like, you know the MagSafe charging on your phone? You put it on your chest and, like, charges somehow. <laughs> the charging light turns screen. Like, oh. Yo, Zach, can you get me real quick? Yeah. <laughs> or like the Apple Pay notification. <laughs> yeah, like, <laughs> I believe that. Uh, the x-rays. That the, I can the, pay the, no, no, Apple no, Pay? No, 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 no. Yeah. Not yet. No, it feels a little weird, honestly. 
But I want to ask Grace. We had a we had Grace Helbig on a couple that's episodes right. ago. But I mean, I know like cancer can be genetic, and like especially breast cancer can just you know happen to anyone. But I I wanted to know if like because like I'm pretty sure my shit came from like electronics on me, and I wanted to see if like maybe she had some sort of like situation with that. But, yeah, yeah. I don't. She's hanging on, under a X-ray the whole time. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, but it it could happen like that. Um, yeah, might as well just live your life to the fullest, you know. Yeah, dude. Even this shit, fucking. The watch, the Apple watches. Yeah, I'm freaked out about that. I'm trying to do cardio at the end of my workouts at the gym. Mm-hmm. Nice. Yeah, I'm back on that train. Because mm-hmm. I was just doing, I would save my cardio for run days, but now I'm doing cardio. I'm trying for bike at yeah. the end of my my days at the. Gym. I've been going uh, to the gym in the middle of the day now, and then it's very interesting because there's all these different types of characters, meaning people who just like have like not real jobs. I think, in my opinion, do you want to tell people? What? That you're unemployed? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm not working for Tiny Fresh anymore. Whoa! Nothing bad, nothing bad happened. Nothing bad happened. Everyone's asking. Godspeed yeah. Tiny Fresh. And you see a tweet from Ethan saying, like, fuck that fucking guy. <laughs> <laughs> Clipped. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> no, I decided to work on the cart full time now. Nice. And live my dreams as a kebab cart owner. So guess what, ladies and gentlemen? But I'm still chill with them. Everything's chill. The unemployed boys are back. Oh, boy. yeah. The boys are back in town. The boys are back in town. <laughs> I, I posted a video uh, yesterday, my haircut video, mm-hmm. where one of my lines that I wrote for myself was that I'm unemployed again. All the comments were like, unemployed again? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, guys, I'm fine. I'm fine. The thing is, it, it, <laughs> I I had a combo. I was like, yeah, I want to slow down and focus on the car or whatever. So technically, I left, but I wanted to post a meme where it goes, I got promoted to customer. <laughs> 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 but, I can't. That's but I'm actually like having the most fun in my quote unquote. Oh, oh no. no, sorry. I'm just saying, what? you can't glorify being unemployed. <laughs> well, this is what I wanted. Yeah. I was going to preface it with a little follow up after. Okay, okay, okay. You fucking dick. Because I was going to double down on what you're saying. It's like, I love this shit. I, I was just about to say yeah, that. I fucking so much fun. <laughs> Dude, so I'm having the most fun in my career and I get like. Back in what, like, we're going to sound like old dudes, but, like, back when we had, like, jobs and shit, like, that rewarding feeling of doing, like, the nine to five. Yeah, like, going yeah, in, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was honestly, like, I miss, like, before COVID when working from home was, like, now it's, like, I feel like the standard of companies and shit. Yeah. I liked going into work. I liked driving. I liked the uh-huh. commute. Like, I got most of my content, like, when I was doing that Vine shit, yeah. like, w- working, like, going in there and, like, yeah, mm-hmm. it felt rewarding. But now, like... I got the freedom to like write my own shit, mm-hmm. at, like post whatever, whenever the Guys, fuck I want. Where, what are you doing? Are you working right now, dude? I can wear a, that shit. a minion costume <laughs> in the middle of the day. In the middle at, on a Thursday, randomly. It was a Monday. It was a no. It was a Monday. Yeah, <laughs> dude. Yeah. I started my week off on a minion costume. You're commuting home, two and it's hours. a Friday, and I still feel the bar <laughs> on my head, which you're, is so crazy. You're listening <laughs> to this. You're driving home on a Monday, two hour drive home. Guess what? We're wearing fucking minion costumes. <laughs> Turn your car around if you're commuting to work right now. <laughs> send that email. Say, you know what? I'm not coming in today. This is not financial advice. But <laughs> the people who work in the middle of the day, or who like don't work in the middle of the day, all have like s- schemes. Yeah. I was sitting at a. I was sitting at a coffee. I was sitting at Phil's. I hope this guy doesn't listen to it. <laughs> know you? Not really. It was weird. It was like so. I was looking at places to host like a pop up or whatever, right? Mm-hmm. And this guy next to me. Like broccoli haircut. Nothing wrong with broccoli haircuts. Right, is this a hierarchy? No, kind of no, no, no. You look like tomato like, guy. Yeah. No, no, no. <laughs> just look up broccoli haircut. You'll know what I'm talking about. Like this kind of kid. Uh, I guess looked over my computer. Broccoli when I was, haircut. Oh, like a fucking like these kids. Yep, 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 yeah, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah. Yep. There's nothing wrong with those haircuts. Dude, the lady with the broccoli <laughs> hair. <laughs> That's who it was. <laughs> oh, got it. Nice. Um, so like a kid like this, right? Did he recognize you before? Is uh, this why you're No, he just saw me looking at like event spaces or whatever, right? Okay. And he goes, uh, uh, after I'm done with my call, he goes, oh, are you into commercial real estate? I was like, oh, no, this is like for this other thing or whatever, right? He goes, oh, dude, I'm like hosting courses on like commercial real estate and like i just look at this unit i just sold for like three million dollars blah 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 he's like you should come join my course like total pyramids i was like dude fuck this <laughs> he had risk. those those are the people who are out during that day those types of people <laughs> it was a customer or it was, it was, like, a, guy it was a guy sitting Phil's? no right next to me at phil's who's staring at my computer looking at event spaces 
And I'm like, oh no, I have this like kebab cart thing. He's like, that makes good money. I was like, yeah, you know, like you know, here and there, or whatever, right? He goes, dude, with commercial real estate, you can make so much money. Look at this space I just got. I'm gonna host a podcast out of it. I'm gonna do this, this, this. It was a weird. It was a weird uh, interaction. What if he's like a fucking millionaire? He probably is. That's crazy. Yeah, a scammer. <laughs> dude, he's a pyramid solo schemer pod for the Riz party. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, dude, I just came back. We're throwing a Riz party tonight. You should pull up. How do you feel about being unemployed? It's great. It's great. It's one of the greatest <laughs> feelings. I, I do not want to glorify it again. But after working for so long, I worked all my life. Yeah. And so just to chill out for like a hot minute. You're the kind of guy. So you've been unemployed before, quote unquote, unemployed yeah. for like a week. I couldn't do it. And then you freak the fuck out. And then you get two jobs immediately. <laughs> I remember this during foul tip. Like you were unemployed. You left market for like a little bit. Or yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. off. Yeah, you were unemployed for like a little bit. We were talking. We we're like, dude, let's just dive in together again. Let's do this <laughs> shit, man. Like we can fucking do it. We'll focus on the pod. We'll do other shit. And blah blah. blah. Like, yeah, 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 I got you. And then fucking. All right, never Boom. mind. I'm right, doing guys. AI. And- I'm in front of, for- I'm front of Forbes. <laughs> <laughs> Relax, me. <laughs> Yeah, but uh, this time, this time I'm chilling. I'm taking it in. I'm having weird broccoli haircut boys conversation. You're at the point now where like I have to text you at like 10 a.m. because you're like sleeping in a little bit. Oh yeah, like, come on. What's the point of waking up? So I got nothing to do. <laughs> <laughs> I've been looking forward to this day all week. This <laughs> really fun. I'm like, excuse me, get out of the house. <laughs> there was a time like last week we were in our group chat and I was like texting back and forth with Zach and I was like. It was like a big decision about the channel or something, and we're like going back and forth. Okay, well, we could do this or this, and then at like noon, three hours after we settled on it, you're like, "Oh, I just woke up." <laughs> <laughs> I'm just enjoying my time. Yeah, but you do have Eve walks at like five. At five a.m. Still, yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. That fucking sucks. Um, yeah. I will say <laughs> that's a huge bite, dude. Huh? <laughs> that was a big bite. No. How is it? It's fucking delicious. Ooh, yeah. there's strawberry in the middle? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Little, well, little spin have- that for the camera. Yeah, 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 yeah. Guys, we're having cake on a Friday. <laughs> okay, the, at 10 a.m. The progress pics have already been posted. We're yeah. good. Look at that. Um, yeah. Happy birthday, cummer guy. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, if anyone's thinking about quitting their jobs or frustrated, just do it. Make it happen. <laughs> just do Don't it. Do Look this. how happy yeah. we are. <laughs> <laughs> Money's not real. Oh, come and go. We got <laughs> <laughs> <We're> rent. <laughs> oh, just do squatting. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's finish off on an AI song uh, about being unemployed. Okay, 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 okay. okay here okay, we go. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, create a hype hip hop song. About glorifying unemployment. I don't have breakfast. And, and how fun it is. So, if you see me eating a lot right now, this is my breakfast. You have your carbs. You have your. <laughs> I also had a coffee. Okay. And now I have a rock star. And now I'm eating a cake. See, guys, <laughs> so. you can't do this on a nine to five. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, dude! I'm like, fucking oh my god! Wait, you guys, this is real. Uh, my fiance Sophie just had her wisdom teeth taken out. Yeah, she just texted me, "I'm ready with 16 Y's," and then texted, "We." <laughs> <laughs> Wait, are you right late? Are I you probably l- need to go. Yeah, but uh, here, let's listen to the song. Okay, then we'll close it off. Okay. Wait, like, <laughs> how close is the place? Like, do you need to go? Uh, she's like 15 minutes away. Oh. She can wait. Yeah, yeah, let, let's do the song. Yeah, we're good. We're song. good. Yeah. We're, we already made the song. Yeah. Might as well listen to it. She already fucked yeah. up on drugs. She's not gonna remember. Yeah. Do, you, do you want the Do you want uh, the first one? Yeah, let's do it. Okay, no here job, we go. Okay, the song's called No Job, No Problem. Wake up in the morning, got no nine to five, no alarm clock, no need to strive. I'm a boss. I make my own rules. No job, no problem. I'm breaking all the rules. Roll out of bed. Wear my favorite hoodie, no punch in the clock Feeling so damn free, catching up on my sleep No deadlines to meet, living like the way I want No job can't complete, no job, no problem I'm living the dream No nine to five <laughs> it's obscene, no stress, no worries, just doing my thing <laughs> Alright guys, thanks for watching 
Stickers. Stickers. Yes. Stickers on uh, shopteamgstudios.com. Dot com. Dot com. Dot TV. Uh, You'll find the link yeah, in the description. The link is yeah. down below. Link's it's in the below description. Zach Walid. Yep. Uh, stickers uh, in the description below. Happy birthday, Look Kenny. Up, hey, hey, thanks, boys. If I see one hate comment about Kenny in the fucking comments, you guys are going to hell, all right? It's fucking birthday. He's not an ogre. He doesn't deserve to shut the fuck up. He's our corner guy, and we fucking love him, all right? I love you guys, man. Happy 30th. Thank you. Happy 31st. I love you guys. Let's fucking go. <laughs>